Pro-Am nope. tournament in 2023. Yeah, sub D-Town, the bits. You also have fallen victim, unfortunately, to Somnus inflation. Um, and the biblical flood, no, yeah, that sounds awful. Also, what's it like living in Oklahoma? Like, I don't, I've never even been to a flyover state. And I feel like it's kind of like, in my brain, it's like middle of nowhere. And I know that's not true, and I don't mean it to be, it's just like, you know. What's the Somnus inflation? Somnus one day caused TT she was spamming TTS so bad in my chat for 45 minutes straight. I had to raise the price of TTS from 200 bits to 300 bits to slow down the flood. I feel like for the fans, Jake, they they probably figure like, hey, you know, if I just if I just don't ever visit Oklahoma in the summer. I did basic trading around that time. Yep. Okay, sounds good. You don't have to convince me. You figure one of them's gonna eventually kind of break on through, right? But this one. Uh, very talented. We know Squid and uh, Kafa Lucamino. We know a lot of these players. That, trust know, me, it does not take much effort to convince me to to, like to not go to, to Oklahoma. Tenders, uh, subs in Overwatch League, you know, playing in the Overwatch League uh, for a while. The only states the that I have any interest in visiting are Florida, a huge test. Uh, Tennessee, was really good, uh, Wisconsin. Uh, we'll see how they play up today. A um, Eva set up here, Nevada. Up. Oh yeah, it's the Reaper. But timeless is going on with they do have the far so teams is gonna have to get super aggressive to make this work I mean, you don't time is not your friend. That's pretty much the stretch would be like Carolina doomed, one of the Carolinas probably south folks here and okay. finished off So maybe peace setting that one up with some icicles you know, finding a Lucio too and yeah, I haven't had I mean, okay actually Texas too. You're right I, I haven't had a desire to visit I had an opportunity to visit Texas and I didn't take it so like I, I was like hmm Maybe I do I really do Maybe I actually don't really want to go there the true power of the Reaper guy. Yeah. I think that was kind of heavily on peace, though, finding huge <laughs> yeah. connections with the icicles, right? Like, they don't really have a hero who's going to shoot up at the far. So having May just hit those connections. And the re the Doom comes out from Kappa. Interesting choice. A pretty good hero against Reaper. And they'll ditch the bat. They'll actually play. Uh, oh, the you know, Doom uh, here now on the uh, May Reaper yeah, so versus Cass Farah so Doom well, explodes. Kappa gets dealt with here as well. So Team Z getting off to a good start. Yeah, and this comp is, I mean, super difficult to come touch the point when you're getting Maywald off and Reaper and D.Va surrounding you, hitting you from all sides. The Farah, in theory, should get some decent spam pressure, but, I mean, with how fast these fights been, he just doesn't have really any time to work with. There's no good time to come to really Oklahoma. Summer is hot as Satan's downstairs bits. Fall basically doesn't exist. Winter we get ice storms. Not snow. Ice. And spring is like a week long. <laughs> so you're telling me you gotta go in that one weekend, one week of spring. You gotta get lucky though. <clears throat> Squid cleaning up their support combo on the opposite side. Reaper just comes in for the last second. I mean, you're gonna convince me twice. I'm not going to fucking Oklahoma, dude. And one little mistake there. I mean, the May keeping the wall up a little bit too long, maybe a miscommunication cost the mech her life. And I mean, if you lose Diva Mech, you're gonna be in big trouble. I mean, Diva really is your only defense against this Farah, against this Cassidy. As Kuffa is giving them absolutely no quarter on the Doomfist, forces the call very early, and I mean, they're just gone. They just slipped away. They Where'd they go? Disappear. I mean, they just absolutely just vanish. Uh, that was Houdini. And oh, this is so annoying. You don't have anyone who can get up here. Fuse Holy around, shit. Forces a ton of skills. Gets the Lucio. Does die for his efforts. But I think you're going to be pretty all right with that as Timeless. As they now rush in as well. Layering on the ults. Layering on the pressure. And then they uh, do find the D-Mech. Yeah, that's finding these last skills. Wait, hold on. He punched wait, the Reaper in. Oh, no. Wait. Wait, he got punched in went for the ult? Holy shit, what a hero play. Reaper go burr. Reaper go burr. Dude, look at that sniping. No, I've never visited Puerto Rico. Uh, you have you have Blizzard here. You have your own beat. I mean, you're in a pretty decent spot to potentially steal this first round. Yeah, and he's hiding with the Blizzard. Would love to get that in on the back line. No easy targets though for it. Then the high noon as well from Vision. Maybe zoning. Maybe touching point. Luke Mino does drop, and Matrix uh -oh. is probably gonna suppress this high noon. And the late Damn it! Did, it did actually outlast it. Here and now, cleaning up Vision onto Squid as as well, forced away, trying to kite back, but the cleanup. It's just too good. Team Z, the death ball, devastating. Grouped up on this Lucio. Yes, the beat comes in from Luke Mino, but it's got to turn into kills. Beat is already expiring. Wait, hold on. Doom found peace. 
Another coalescence. That's the beauty of playing Moira is the coalescence builds so fast. Yeah, you don't need hit scan. Just get coalescence and just chase the far around the map. That is a really interesting comp there for Team Z. Definitely gave some trouble over. Got the half the end, but an hour and a half. That's pretty cool. Would have been cleaner for Team Z if they didn't, you know, have that main wall. Come to Brazil. We have summer one, summer two, ultra summer, summer three, and in the coldest capital of country, two weeks of variation between five C to thirty C. How good and survivable like venture trade. Yeah, I'm, I'm all set. Thank you though. He's like up to three hundred HP now. He's still invested. With the life steal and then also. May. I mean, those are two heroes that are very difficult to deal with as well. Yeah, are you sure? Yeah, I'm good. I think I would melt. What the fuck is a C? Yeah, true. Can we get that in freedom units? Wow, Sebastian May versus the Ash Tracer Winton. Yes, you've got drone, but I think the dive would be probably overwhelming, so... It's going to be on dynamite and, and these uh, these nades to get the cleanup on the back line. And okay, May split, naded, forced to ice block to Ooh. cleanse that off. Vision in Missed this it. nice wide angle bastion, struggling to find purchase. And Timeless are content to just pressure this point, slow the game down. Hey, you've got to push a team Z. You've got to get out on the objective. Another nade. Okay, so use the bastion shift. Drone, not an overcommitment. Wait, wait, oh, wait. And ice. An overcommitment. I think he just blinked into an icicle intended for somebody else. So he's going to feel good about that one. They do get rid of X Cal though. They get rid of that Bastion, right? So that's like a large source of damage. Nice Maywall here though from pieces. Ooh, good. The point. That's good uh, Ramatra slow right, right there. there. Just so much damage coming out here from Team Z, and that's going to be a fast flip. Yeah, it's a great Ravenous Vortex. By Painkiller, denies Kuffa's jump out. Hanbei is traded. Oh, sorry. Though, so Ravenous on, Vortex, true. Right now, and Tracer kills too, because that's just some Tracer so right there. strong on the flank on this Tracer. I think one of the stronger Tracers outside of the very top oh, teams the in the region. And here's why. He's just eating. I mean, oh, look at that. That's nice tracking. Very, very clean. So Doom kind of keeps this one alive. And Painkiller just trying this to... This is very nice tracking. You are correct can, there, Jake. Very limited. Uh, Kira, me think the brand. Appreciate you, dude. Thank, thank you. Nades in onto backliners, even if they don't always result in kills, they're forcing important skills, and maybe more importantly, they're denying Team Z any opportunity to progress the map. Full swap comes in. Four heroes change for Team Z. It's a good comp, but I think the match is pretty even. Is this pre hot fix? Nope. Timeless have a big bank. Overwatch is almost but always played on current yeah, patch nowadays. Now goes over to the Echo. That's what uh, we saw the other day. Some really nice play. It'll be a nano here on to cover. It's gonna just force Team Z back there. Just gonna if it was before hot fix, you'd probably see a good amount of Alari actually. And then they just deal with cover. They just come right on in. Now they end up using the sound barrier. It's pretty good for Team Z, even though the Bob is used here. Yeah, Kuffa not primaling there. Maybe a pain Basically, issue. Basically, my city is trying to pasteurize the people in the winter. Stabilize things as Team Z, all players extremely lucky. The meat looks like it was enough to. What does that even mean? Doom doesn't want to let anyone recover. Is going to be able to stay alive. Clutch up against Excal and a nice sleep. Delayed kill onto Lan and. I mean, that could have been a disastrous scenario. Losing no Juno, day. no, no oh, Juno. The, the beat just stabilizes it all. And Team Z, I mean, that's the downside, right, of making this full comp swap. If they had had like one more ultimate to layer in there, I think they very easily could have cleaned up. But just having nothing left, I mean, at least they're close to the rush. But now Kuffa does have the primal to work with, and it's going to be very hard to deal with this Winston. You don't have any easy way to peel him off, especially something like your Echo. No, in the last fight, I think Team Z, they had a little bit of advantage, but just pushed really deep into the spawn. A nice bio, that's going to get cleans on the Painkiller. It's going to be the Kitsune Rush here over the point. Is, is no. Team Z. Do you know it's just not that good? This one back with nice shots there from Vision, who takes out x -Cow. So deal with the Tracer, Vision will fall. Juno's nice better after the buffs, but from peace, picking up some kills on the there's no reason to play Juno right now. A bit of a scrap. Yeah, Timeless still trying to fight this out here. Luke Mino... That's all the heels down. So Don't diss Juno. Down Nobody's dissing Juno. Guys. We're watching Pro play talking about why they're not playing Juno. Peace is forced to copy just to stay alive. And I mean, that's going to be the best use of the ultimate. I don't think he's going to get much of anything in terms of. I promise you, it won't, it won't hurt you if you talk about gonna, why pros are not playing a certain character. In. Very low opportunity to chase here. Kuffa strikes with the nano onto Peace. Yeah, no flight, no escape. Excal trades it back on the vision. So the fight is still in contention for Team Z. Timeless electing just to force this point, bring the defenders to them. Great nade onto Tracer. They don't have to play anything. They play what is the best characters to win. So far, cleanse as well comes out. 
Doom with the pulse doesn't connect. Yes, it does take the Diva Mech out and Kuffa still alive. Decently healthy. Wait, burst it Wait, down. What? Hold on. The trades come in. Lugmino hacked. Can't get his beat off. Squid's gonna die late. I love how Jake paused there for a sec. Did you guys notice he paused when he said that? Still gonna kind of build up percentage of the piece on the Sombra coming back. Making a few big plays with the Max there. A little pause, a little... And then continue on. The bad thing is, you don't have this mech for Pinko. Now you're gonna get it back, but you're gonna have double support ult here for Team Z. You're gonna have another Kitsune rush. Hanbei building them rather quickly. Yeah, Kuffa needs to find something 90 to this primal. I think that's going to be the critical factor here. Squid, he's positioned so They both safe. actually moved over to Somber Tracer. Back onto the Diva, going to help that point pressure battle. Lucio playing very safe. Gets a slightly better beat off, but still very much in contention as Kuffa juggling that Lucio back to his team. Oof. Lugmino, though, does go down first, gets hacked. Somber tries to fall back, see if Squid can keep her alive. Almost gets him. Maybe just barely, but it feels like Team Z has the edge in this fight. It's a mess. Xcal finds Doomed and maybe that'll be enough. Squid desperately trying to get to that nano. Can't quite manage it yet. Pulse bomb yeah, I don't see a junk grab meta happening for a while. Damn. I'm actually very surprised. I thought this was a timeless game. Team Z looking pretty good though. I do do informed delivery. I do, I do. And there was a I, I got a new card sent to me, and I never got a, an email for informed delivery. It just never showed up. I think the quality of T500 players varies per continent, because I find EU harder than North America. T250 support. I do love the hard the question Bap to answer to be honest with you two months I just, on offense in particular I love Bap's ability to get to the high ground and never received Diva, who can really utilize Bap's heels to right. you know, make that forward position and, and keep moving the cart but it is both teams going Winston is like very normal very expected here and this is exactly what Timeless wanted right like a situation where the comps are very normal and very I gotta fucking request one. another one you know they've had experience in these matchups before and so the question now is Team Z, they've they've snowballed these advantages from cheesing into map wins, which is impressive. It's ridiculous. Can you generate that same kind of advantage in a very straightforward front to back mirror? Yeah, it's I mean, so I, I think well, obviously it'll be Team Z on offense. We'll see what they decide to do here. Is uh Xcal hovering the widow could be for uh I mean you can run widow on this map, could be in response, could also be just to take a shot and then change as uh Peace will play the Tracer. I like how they're coming out. But I mean, both teams, right? We saw like Alara the other day. We've seen Zen on this map. Oh, I like the decision to have that Brig on a back line uh, for both sides. Uh, that's a nice shot there from Vision to open things up. Yeah, Vision with a great jump shot punishes the spawn peak. Don't think Xcal ever saw that one coming. Basically, never, never expect that angle to be threatened by an enemy Widow. And once again, see if Vision can connect again. Just going off timing here, but Xcal was patient, waited that one out. Team Z, though, you got to break this open. I mean, Kuffa and Doom, they're doing a great job just cycling their bodies onto the objective, not letting it roll, keeping pressure on the back line. Yes, uh, some shots here. Uh, from Yo, Fats, you're running so many ads? It's a crazy killer. Uh, yeah, I run increased ads during drops. I always tell you guys that. That's by design. Thus far is Cart still has not really made much of any progress. This is exactly what Timeless wanted, right? Put Kuffa in this position to kind of control this show. Oh, Lugmino naded. Little overextension there, trying to challenge the Winston. Gets punished, and now Timeless down. Ooh, one. what a shot! Killing the Widow's nice, but it might not be enough, right? With both supports still alive for Team Z. Squid's gonna Ooh. have to oh. vision with a trick. Another one! Okay, that's what they need. And another headshot under the Winston. Forces him back. Okay, the Widow basically just solo held this one down after Luke Mino got naded. Vision looking very scary on the Widow. You've got to be a little bit worried as Team Z when a Widow starts popping off on Dorado. Sometimes there's not so much you can do about that. Uh, I mean, it allows your team to kind of like hold on to, you know, just getting those early pickoffs, right? It allows your team to oh, hold on to so many. It's okay, boy, uh, wonder. I'm used to it at this point. That's also, they end up using the nano there onto Painkiller while you're losing both supports instantly. I mean, that is is quite brutal there for Team Z is is still going to be in control the show painkiller actually goes with the primal here so he'll actually take out both supports they deal with squid and now they get luke amino here i wonder because of that close spawn uh you no know, because of the offensive spawn if you can like kind of make this into something yeah but i mean kuffa could always just return the favor and go with like a trade primal of his own looks like he's gonna be forced to do that and juggling the enemy winston in oh no painkiller without the primal has no option to escape 
Kafa. Half HP nated, still wants to get to the mech, still catches those supports. Beautiful jump, big landing oh. damage straight onto the back line. And that was gross. What a separation right there. Pinkler, his dive was good, but maybe should have recognized that, that the response was just way better from Timeless. As now Tracer are going to be waiting it in the flank, set up in a position. Uh -oh. <laughs> high graphic. <laughs> Did you see that, by the way? That's a uh, um, graphical <laughs> settings difference. Probably doesn't it doesn't exist. Uh, I know for sure it doesn't exist. I never seen that. Graphical before. settings diff. Oh God. That's a good example of why you play on all low, chat. This is not what you want to see. When the, the spectator client, the people who are spectating don't spectate on low graphics, but they, the players play on low graphics, so it looks like he's staring at a fucking banner. That's awesome. Has not had to leave this uh, roof of the building here. So funny. Pretty much the entire game is uh, now you're gonna just ditch the widow completely. So just gonna gonna give up on it here. I literally did answer you. I said it's hard to say. Absolutely desperate to get the car moving. Yeah, and you don't want to be in a, in a desperate scenario like this with a rally available for the defense. Oh, you, you didn't listen. That's not on me. Back off the angle. Kuffa does bubble, so maybe lacking maybe all the resources he would want. But oh, what a disgusting kill from Doom, punishes Excal, caught alone. And I mean, from bad to worse here on Dorado, supports caught away from the dive. A pulse Blink through, I don't know if you meant to do that. Ambitious maybe. Sometimes it happens. He does find vision in the chaos. So without the window, Nano onto Painkiller, Primal as well, should be enough to start opening this up. Luke Mino desperately with this rally, trying to keep Squid alive and all perfect boop there. Yeah, he's, yeah, yeah you're just, well. yeah, you're, you're cooked. So he's just well cooked. Alive. That well, he lived actually. Nice job staying alive. Time to return the favor. And remember, Vision's back on the high ground right now. Going to be shooting down to the cart. Everyone's getting cleaved by Brig and Winston into the Widow sight line, into the Tracer. And that's not what you want to be doing against. It's a team wipe for Timeless. Full holding, basically, where you see the cart. And that was, this was destruction. You want to go check your card? You Why well, is it before I left, though? That's, that clean. that's not a lot of progress. I wasn't, I didn't say it like as I was uh, leaving, did I? This was a bit of a beat down here in map number two, which is a bit surprising, uh, you know, with uh, how map number one went. It was uh, very back and forth. The Team Z made some you know, really nice changes, got into things uh, that mm. ended up working out for them. Uh, this, I feel like, though, Vision just dominated. I mean, there was no answer. Yeah, time looks really good there. Just like lights out. It felt like every time we were on board with Vision, connecting with at least like, you know, two players, headshots constantly. Yeah, I think, um, to be honest, I think back to map one. You and I am playing, spend thousands of dollars on a high-end PC only to play on the lowest setting for a gameplay advantage. Yep, that's me. Hi. To be fair, Cassidy, Farah, Doofus is, is a doing? garbage comp too. So I think Timeless kind of cheesed themselves on the first round. And then second round, <laughs> yeah. maybe because of stuff like Bastion or the threat of potential cheeses, they played the Lucio in the dive instead of the Brig, which, which also I think put them on the back foot against uh, the, the Diva Echo and like the super aggression that Team Z countered with. Yeah, unfortunately, this is an airport. You don't really have to announce your departure. Very stable comp. They look super difficult to catch on the back. Line. I mean, Squid's aggressive nades have only increased in consistency. <clears throat> Painkiller goes to the Diva, trying to find something here. Mm. But that, if anything, is more frames over nicer really games. Better. Absolutely. Free to walk up on the offense and an instant TP to the high ground. I love this move on Dorado. Yeah. Mitigates some of the real difficulty in breaking out of your spawn. And now Vision can go back to the Widowmaker here yeah. as, uh, as soon as you get everybody here up onto the high ground. So I feel like you really need Excal to start Big coming alive. Nade. Nice nade there on the and piece and Painkiller. Oh. Yeah, what is this angle? Is this map is actually yeah. just done. Like, it's just so... Oh but my god. I mean, highly unlikely. The, the comeback is so difficult because now Timeless, they're not even going to kill the Baby Diva. They're going to wait till they push the card to just about the end and then just pounce on this Diva with an anti-nade from Squid. I mean, I can see the future. Man, I can see the future, and it's not pretty for Team Z on Dorado. All right. Nah, Painkiller's on an epic flank here. Painkiller's gonna come on the Baby Diva and mech drop the back. Okay, oh, Nate on both backliners, they're dead. Oh, they're gone. Vision's just yeah, SMG and no. cart. He doesn't need to do anything else. Yep. To put the pressure on. That's Vision tough. Can't get any purchase, and uh, yeah, okay. That was a map. That was that was one of the quickest maps. I mean, that aside was... from like a two-minute cap on push or something, that is about as quick as it gets. Like. <laughs> That was uh, that was one of the fastest games of Dorado that I can ever remember. Uh, I know uh, we've had a few. Uh, you know, I, I say that we did cast you know a team no in 0 and 40. I'm sure there's one in there that's 
you know, probably there. faster. Damn, poor um, Shanghai. Some other teams that, you know, if we can find a way to nope, this isn't a rush league. This is OWCS. I mean, this is I like face, you know, it it's it's like face it league. It's like face it kind of took over agree. running agree. Overwatch esports stuff. But if you re good. When, when you retake second point on defense, they kind of just gave him the keys. Ground and third point, you just see Cart basically from spawn on Widow. Kind of owns there. So yeah, maybe of course I, I would be shocked. Division played it through second, but like the players the part was fine. The coaches, you know, all that stuff was great. Really but have a lot of impact. Corpus yeah, side was Ash genuinely like evil. Of the picks, right? Yeah, yeah. This is, a, this is a, the most normal pick I yeah, think. This for is defense what I start. See, though. You don't know what teams he's gonna run out with. Are they gonna play Sim Bastion? See my you have to kind of price that in. Land on the life weaver. Oh, okay, I don't yeah. know what is being cooked. Sure, Reinhardt? surely not. This is like my average rank game. I'm like, oh, we have Life Weaver, yeah. Reaper, and Reinhardt. Oh, this will be great. This is awesome. <laughs> this would be like if Reinforce was a coach, he'd just be like frantically shouting heroes before the doors are about to open, <laughs> and they'd just be like shuffling through all of them. Eyes. Uh, the only it's funny. Hanzo here. I, a piece played a really good Echo the other day. I would, uh, yeah. yeah, I'd like to see the yeah. Echo. Yeah. Does really anyone actually use it over the in game? I will say Luke Mino has the opportunity to really. Yeah, There's a whole thing so, there. You know, I, I'm, I'm not gonna get into it. In this comp with some well placed boops. They mean well. I, I do think they genuinely mean well. Start touching this point, and now Timeless got to respond to that. Kuffa really doesn't want to give up this off angle flank, flank right? Like really wants to threaten the possibility of a backline dive, but is gonna fall back before he loses his armor. Yeah, bio grenade on a pain kill on the point, but there's gonna be nothing to follow up on it. Looks like players from Timeless actually get like knocked down to the low ground here, or maybe they decide to jump. So uh, you now have Squid Luke Amino and Face it was huge for CS. Yeah, but they're not. They don't remember why Face it became huge for CS. Takes out Hanbei. That's a lot of the healing. Another bio grenade connects here from Squid. So uh, that'll be a first fight. Like I'm not the most well versed in CS lore, but I I got a bit of a lore connoisseur to explain to me why. And now it makes sense, but they they're not applying that in Overwatch yet. The biggest problem for face stuff is they want people to pay for their leagues. Nobody's gonna do that. But some people argue it's like, well, they do it in CS, yeah, but they didn't do it at first. Everyone did free stuff at first, and then eventually it became paid stuff. Nope, no better anti cheat. Nope, nothing like that. They just kind of want people to pay and be in the league, like pay for to be in like these like leagues and tournaments, and nobody's gonna do that. There's the culture doesn't exist for that yet. Another fight goes in timeless's favor. I I just think it gives you so much flexibility, like uh the 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 brig with the Ana, and then uh, kind of having the Winston in the mix. I think there's like some maps you definitely need the Lucio, right? Maybe uh, someday, but like not for now. Or, definitely you know, not gonna happen for a while. Uh, Escort maps, right, on the defensive side of things. I think this comp's pretty awesome. Yeah, I'm a big fan of it, and I think it also frees Got up to support to the homies B backslash. Right? Thanks, so Sholo. Right? Uh, losing only 11 months as well. Appreciate it. you guys have been going crazy with the subs quiet. recently. And the nade follow up. There's no cleanse. Appreciate you guys. How's the big dog doing low. today? Does go good. Down in the carnage, but Got some good sleep today. Um, so I feel a lot better. And that was really that's one of your most potent tools for shutting. I don't know if I'm gonna go gig along today though. We'll see. And it doesn't connect. Yeah, Squid is on another level right now. When you when you create space for this guy, as Timeless is is clearly aware of and and prioritizing, he is just delivering so so many connections on the nade. Doomed is also in a, in a theoretically a tough spot on Tracer. It's like hard to find the pulse bombs, but he's been doing it. Oh, they're gonna fight in the rush up here. That's actually the. So we rush from us. Don't turn to online he's casino ads like CS did. The uh, if the money is offered, I could see them taking it. The You'd be surprised. Timeless definitely wasn't prepared for that. Yeah, that's a great dive with the nade. Is I mean, you have no answer for that on timeless, and so the copy. I don't have much faith. Dominantly wins in the fight. Kuffa doesn't even want a primal, right? I think this is a wise decision, though. You know, I don't think it, we would have been able to win this fight with primal. Would have. Uh, air cloud thing the prime. So take the reset. You have back spawns though, so teams are going to get a lot of purchase here on second point. Squid, it's a little bit deep for going for that sleep. Okay, he does get saved by the team as they fall back to the spawners. And it is going to be get, the second point car push. I do get why Timeless felt comfortable play, fighting in that Kitsune rush, right? They kind of have the benefits of the rally. It's a, sh a small area. You have the clean, Yeah, that sounds awful, Big Ben. Uh, and the brig, you probably have a bio grenade of your own. I just don't think they accounted for a duplicate with a bio grenade that comes in from Team Z, which uh, it was really well played there from Peace. Yeah, in the end, it's a huge ultimate commitment. And Timeless, happy to slow Ooh. the game down. Kuffa drops super low here. Doesn't want to primal defensively, though. Really looking for the opportunity to get aggressive. How goes the farm? Not bad. Today's been a very chill day, though. Vision to shut down peace. 
Kiri forced out. Diva really does not want to lose the mech. Oh, and she forces self destruct. Yeah, I think he has to there. Would have been What's with the weird Concord Diva hate boner in the last few days? Keep the tempo rolling by like, I feel like if you just don't like a game, you just don't talk about it, you know? But, like, I feel like so many people just literally have hate boner for that game. And it's like, dude, I played it. I thought it had potential, but it didn't get cooked long enough, so it's not that great, and I moved on, and I literally didn't think about it since. Hi, Flats. Hope you're doing well. Macho the 11 months. Yeah. <laughs> Enjoy your waffles, dude. When you say that, because it's been cooking for eight years, I know that, but, like, it doesn't, it, like, in this instance, it doesn't matter how long it's been cooking, the quality's not there. You know? Yeah, but yeah, they just yeah. finish her off, and I mean, like you have this Kitsune Raj, but it just feels so threatening with Kuffa holding the forward choke. I don't know when I when I don't like something, I just move on. He's gonna jump back. The team's gonna full cut you. I feel like that's a foregone conclusion. But how do you break this choke without popping a Kitsune Raj? Right? Like this backline is so ready to fall back. You gotta dislodge Kuffa somehow. Uh, I just don't get it. For his trouble. You're gonna lose uh, Painkiller. I thought you were gonna lose the mech yet again. I mean, you, you don't even have the time to get to the choke and actually... Yeah, you're not wrong. Scenario. You're not wrong about that. It seems like you're just gonna be but it, it definitely went... It's definitely gone a little far. Because, like... You're just gonna see I mean, there was... The bob on right through, there was people doing hate raids on anyone who was streaming uh, the, the game. You're gonna have to, what, use the so it's like... Bob, uh, it's, uh, uh, people not think that's going a little too far. Direction, so. Now they're gonna go from the high ground directly here into the back line. This is gonna be... The Kitsune rush use no do you not do you not think at that point rally. that's yeah, wrong i've seen further that, kill on is that is the stupidest right? fucking response i've ever seen and i think timeless probably gonna just slow play this like genuinely that is quite quite possibly one of the dumbest responses you could ever have to a, to a situation like that in the contention here on second but this nano could come into so you watch somebody get robbed and you're like yeah well i watched someone get murdered Okay, like fuck, dude. What does that mean? Like, <laughs> like that doesn't make it any better. It just means that there's all oh, it can get worse. That doesn't. That doesn't mean it's like what? Hello? That's insane. That's literally insane. From timeless, you could shut down this tracer, maybe. I don't know if you would get a touch. Yeah, deadlock's cool. I should probably be playing a lot of that next week. Really has to win this one v one. It's kind of for all the marbles. Slips away, but Luke Mino is waiting for him. Did get the overtime touch, but I mean, it's too little, too late here. No shot. You win the fight here. Six man bomb? No. That's funny. Our, our two highlights of the day should just be uh, any who's pole spawn uh, in an absolute drubbing of a loss and then not self-destruct. Those are our highlights of the day. And honestly, King's Row, I was hoping for some kind of wild and wacky cheese. Will Denlock be the return of the bird to the streams with my streams? He's like really high in Mar, so I would have to like grind a bunch to get up there. Um, Even last patch... I, think I, I could in the future probably, but I'd have to I'd have to put in some hours before that could happen because I don't want to like ruin his games. Time only makes Squid's job easier finding those nades, right? A little bit less to work with for Painkiller. Yeah, and like a lot of the Matrix just kind of like used to, uh, you know, get like near that high ground. He's been streaming all day, dude. He's been waiting for that game for months. He's been grinding it off stream for he has like probably a hundred hours or so. To the the Ana because like the defense Matrix. Uh, just kind of yoinked up uh, all of the. Uh, you know, He's been waiting. He's been ready like this whole time. Sorry here. You have nothing to apologize about. You've played phenomenally this far. Okay, take it back. <laughs> Where'd it go? We'll see. We'll see if it's enough here for Team Z if they can stabilize. Maybe on defense. Yeah, what Winston skin is that? It's up here. Wait, let me see. Let me take a look at this. Is this the BlizzCon one or what is that? Oh, that's not the BlizzCon one. What is this Lines? thing? I need this. It's like some. On. It's like oh, it's I know what that is. Is it, is it like Pacific or Atlantic or? No, it's like the Poseidon one. It's like a epic. It goes crazy. You know, Ocean. got a good Winston skin. Ocean Winston, yeah. It's kind of a vibe, and they're gonna go with the Echo on offense. So maybe not wanting to have that vulnerability of the hit scan, harder to get an angle on offense. I don't mind this. We'll see how Stop it did. Thanks for eight months. Hey, streamer. Hello. Oh, well. for being entertaining. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate eight months. I also think you feel uh, pretty comfortable running the Echo because you have a good idea there's not going to We're having a league for what, oh, see? I mean, it was kind of more of a stopgap. Oh, have something no. to stream and something this to do, waiting for Deadlock. Because really I think a lot of people expected Deadlock to get announced at um, no 
like Dota's big tournament in September. Minyot, thank you the Prime. Very aggressive from Team Z. As soon as they spot an opening, they are going to charge for it and get a what should be a full easy team wipe here. Maybe Luke and Kuffa can escape. Luke and King Mo, I think it was 16 months. Appreciate it. Only Kuffa lives. Maybe you can throw some sort of spawn camp here, but I don't think you really have the comp to win a spawn camp fight against Brig and Axcal. Trying to do too much. I understand it in the situation you're in, but it gets punished. And now Timeless should be able to roll the card potentially through this choke that was so difficult for Team Z. Maybe it's just going to be uncontested for Timeless. Yeah, and I think, uh, you know, having the Echo in the mix puts even more pressure onto the D.Va, right? You know, you can't, uh, no Matrix for that focusing beam. You also then have the nades that have come through from Squid constantly. <laughs> and I think uh, where the payload is, Jake, I mean, for Timeless, you can just play around like one big kind of, like, beginning a deadlock. Yeah, so I mean, rush here for Hanbe. you're not wrong with that. They just kind of walk back, and they're going to build up a primal onto this. You're not wrong with that. It can get a little bit boring, but, like, if you get really good at, like, stealing their points... While also getting your own points, it's it's interesting. It's stuff to do. Primal juggling to Lucio. Oh, whoa, Vision, hold on. Maybe Doom is the tracer player of the team. We'll see if Doom can clutch it out. Even with the nanos, not quite enough here. They do lose players, but the attacker spawn advantage should be enough to clean us out. Maybe Squid can snipe down that Lucio. Yeah, Len doing a great job with the wall ride to slip out there, though. Yeah, Kuffa sent Len into orbit, and I think, you know, Vision... How many ads you run in a single drop day? Approximately. Yes. Got actually destroyed by Hanbei. A little bit of a... A little bit of a misplay. But Doom has looked great on the Echo. And now with the rally, right? Fighting into the car against the rally is a really challenging proposition. Nade onto the D.Va. Already forces the cleanse out. Pulse easily blocked by the Brain. Hey, a touch? Not much hope there. Does eat the... Oh, it's eaten. Huge. Yeah, B does help... But the copy diva and the rally are gonna really be great for the sustained fight here. Beat oh, needs to find more. Big nade. Once again, Yo, what's up, Johnny? Thank you, five gifts, his buddy. Big bomb over the point. Appreciate the big five gifted subbies. Appreciate you, Chad. Give some issues. Thank you. So you guys have been going crazy with the gifties and subs this week. We're almost. I think we're almost back at 8k subs. It might have come down since then, but we were almost at 8k. It was up there. And I mean, okay. Dude, we're 2-1 yeah. we're in the series, and I'm just wondering what... Damn, Timeless looks really good now. They lost the first map, but... About we farm today. Thanks, Johnny. Yeah, I Appreciate no it. I mean, uh, yeah, the, the map number one seems like an anomaly. Oh, I fell a bunch in the last two days. God damn. Uh, they run some interesting stuff. See, that's why that's why you don't pay too much attention to a sub count, because it always goes up and down. It's also, like, timing is a big part of it, too. I know, even, like, the high end of, like, Chinese You know? And like they're all or become pro to try keep the viewers. No, no, that's so ass backwards. Dude, you know how many pros are in Overwatch and they get like 10 viewers? Dude, nobody gives a fuck 90% of the time. Like in some in other games, yeah, a lot of top players are also pros. But it's not like not being a pro makes you a creator. That is not true. Not nearly as dominant. And even Timeless agrees, they're also gonna match the Lucio carry. I mean, having a high pace, high tempo, super valuable here. Somber Tracer, definitely an odd choice for vision. The amount of the amount of really good players that have the personality of a fucking wet rock. There's a dime a dozen against the Somber Tracer dive, so I think Timeless uh, maybe has had the wrong read here, but then again, if you just execute perfectly with Sombra Tracer here, it's possible. I do think Reaper kind of is going to have a field day, not really much to deal with him. Be wild if they took us to a game five off the back of two map wins off of the, the Reaper May. <laughs> so that would, please, I don't want to have Reaper in my ranked games, Matt. Please. Oh, look at the Reaper. First night of an avocado? No, that's insulting to avocados. And now it's going to be scary to walk in. He's going to do it anyway, though. I think this is what you got to do on Reaper. You got to stay aggressive. They turn on to Doom. There's not too much damage on the side of Timeless, but they do get the point flip. Team Z now trying to restore their cooldowns, trying to reset. But Kuffa doesn't want to let them do that. He's playing on his armor so well on this Winston, you know, managing the HP bar. With it's like most people would watch a good player or so that's far, some bronze player. That's not true. Mobility. Reaper is just not finding Dude. Purchase. I mean, it's also kind of a little bit odd because, like, Team Z wasn't. Really, I mean, looked at their health bars. Oh, really, like, in, like, correct me if I'm wrong. But what wasn't Kai kind of terrible at Elden Ring at first when he first started playing and everyone was laughing? Like, dude, people don't people don't show up because of how good you are at the game. They show up because you're entertaining. You know, um, like 
yeah, being a really good player in a game in a niche can absolutely help you, but like, that doesn't, just because you're good at a game doesn't mean people are going to show up. Nobody gives a fuck nowadays. If anything, there's becoming a movement against Giga Sweat players where like, people want games to be fun. You know? This time it's Doom or Vision rather who gets shut down. I mean, these little picks, they do start to add up. You gotta be careful now, Timeless. They don't wanna turn this into a team wipe. They are gonna just full commit with the beat, trying to take this fight. Very risky with only four players, but they do punish Excal, catching peas out alone, should be isolated. Are you probably I swear you would thought from Doom, they so never interacted with another human really without how awkward they are? Yeah. 100%. 100%. Quite get the beat, and then the EMP came in. So timeless. Looks like they are gonna clutch this one. Like out. being being good at video games does not translate. Than they would have wanted here, honestly. I mean, yeah. In a position where you just need a retake, maybe once you can probably close out this first point. Eighty-three is a little scary though. It's right on that edge. Beat primal EMP. I mean, that's a lot there to use. As I would take a look at uh, replay here from Peace. Oh, Majax. Oh. Ooh. Love a little Majax. Oh, not, oh, nothing quite hits the same as a real Ajax, but you know, Majax yeah, yeah, yeah. kind of tied us over for the moment. So we'll see Timeless, Elusive, very hard to catch. I get that, but Goes I think on Overwatch now. critters outside of top 500 are not that famous. And now falling back, Overwatch has been a game, though, that's been out for so many years. Most of those people leave. Like, you think XQC is still top 500? You think Tim is still top 500? Do you think Moon Moon was still top, would still be top 500 these days? No, they, they, they pieced out. and Timeless. A lot of people that are still here today and doing that are here because they've put so many hours in. They're still top 500. Like, they're like, you're 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 kind of having a false equivalency because like, most of those people that play Overwatch every day and have been here making content for years and are good at making content got good at the game all over time, right? Like, they still are good, whether they're former pros or people that just play the game a lot. Like. Of course, the people that play Overwatch eight day, eight hours a day are most likely to be top 500, right? Um, but, like, you could say that about most games. A Tim the Tatman Winston stream would pull 40k viewers because he's built his brand. Yeah, because it would be funny. Also, t also flats, Tim wasn't top 500, GM usually not top 500. Oh, back in the day. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, back in the day, it was a lot more competitive, I feel like, than it is now. Because, like, also, now it's split by roll, you know what I mean? So, what I'm, what I, the point I was trying to make was, to, with today's, like, those are people that are most likely already in this game, and, like, this is their main force, source of content. Like, they make sort of content around the game, and it's, like, their number one thing. So, yeah, of course they're going to be top 500. And, like, most people that aren't either either newer or just haven't been around as long, right? And it's also hard to compete with the people that have been around for a very, very long time. She has a little bit less HP, a little bit easier to kill, but she does quite a bit more damage and has more mobility now in this patch. Squid's super low. Wow. I mean, look at that. That's like Falls of Steel to hold on to that self-cleanse. Now uses it, keeping himself up. The Blizzard did catch Lumino, and B comes in over the top. You'd think that'd be enough, but fighting on the rush... So different, so it's like, completely different. Completely different. Still staying alive on this Kiriko, a masterclass by Squid, and the high mobility flankers from Timeless are trying to clutch this Also out. moved on. Um, I actually don't think Overwatch is in that bad a spot, a spot viewership-wise these days. Like, drops should be your number one indicator, because, like, it just means that average, everyday Overwatch content is kind of boring. And it's, like, not because any of the creators are bad at what they're doing, um, and it doesn't matter who they are. It doesn't matter if it's me, it doesn't matter if it's Emong, it doesn't matter if it's pro players or top level players. Like, it doesn't matter, because every day, game in and game out, is very similar to the previous game, right? Like, you've, if you've played or watched Overwatch for a long time, you you know what the matches look like, no matter what. Like, they're not that much different. There's no there's no shtick, there's nothing exciting. That's why at the beginning of every season, it goes to the moon, and then comes crashing back down after. Because um, everyone wants to see the new shit, experience the new shit, see everyone talk about the new shit, and then once all the, the buzz dies down, it's like, ranked game number 641. Do you know how hard it is to make thumbnails and titles for ranked game number 641? Like, ask Retro, that poor fucking bastard, dude. Because sometimes he puts out titles and thumbnails for videos, and I look him dead in the eyes and go, how the fuck did you come up with this? 
And it is the worst title thumbnail I've ever seen in my entire life. But I can't be mad at him, because he's had to do it 800 times in a row, and you run out of ideas. Right? Like, like I'm never mad at him, I'm never like, this is fuck- I'm never like, fuck you, you're fired. But I'm like, dude, this is dog shit. <laughs> we have to figure that out, because of how terrible it is to figure out each time. And it's way easier when there's a content that, like, spectating, or there's a shtick to it, or covering news, or whatever it is. Um, and that's just where Overwatch is. That's where we're at. That's where we're at. All the educational content's been made. All the pro, all the pro content's been made. Uh, it's over. Like it, there's no there's no new shit to make. There is no new shit to make. It's just recycling and reusing everyone all the old stuff. So the average viewer typically doesn't want to watch that. What Twitch viewers are now today is for Twitch and for the. Yo, motherfucker! So you're in a really Hello? Spot there. Uh, Did elephants move in? Is, um, yeah, their, their lives are on the line what it is now is mostly people that are enjoy that streamer. It's been all timeless ever since then. They enjoy that streamer. And half of them enjoy that streamer because they play X game. The other half because they enjoy that streamer, period. From timeless. The only silver lining for Team Z is that they don't commit anything to that fight. And I mean, the point isn't even <laughs> you know? open So, yet. like... So it's like on an average day, on an average day, if I stream Overwatch the entire day, the whole day after Emon gets off, hello? Um, anyways, um, I could get to like 3k probably, 3k viewers on the day, but if I stream variety, depending on what game it is, I can get, I could get like half of that or a little bit less than half of that, um, or if it's an exciting new game, then I can get even more than that more than half you know so it's like half of it's gonna always be just people that are only for that one thing um and the reason why you see when creators swap games they do it slowly is because they got to rebuild that other half right so like let's say 50 percent of your viewers only watch you because they want to watch that get you play that game the other 50 percent want to just watch you right so when you do swap games you got to rebuild the pfft, you got to rebuild the other 50% so you do it slowly and over time. But that first 50% of the people that want to watch you no matter what, we're going to be there anyways. Okay, that boot. That was a little bit lucky. You take those. You take those. Hey, that was sick. They're uh, from Painkiller. Just knocks Kappa uh, off base uh, when they kind of go uh, up into the sky. Uh, and, you know, Kappa had released uh, benefits of the sound barrier there as well. So you definitely could have kept that one going. Yeah. This one feels like you're gonna get a fight here from Timeless, but feels like it's gonna. I'm gonna come becoming a Stardew player. I'm not maybe, becoming maybe a Stardew player. Stardew is fun though. Dude, he fell off again. Off Dude, Kafa, what's going on, brother? You were the chosen one. The flip comes in. Rush as well. Timeless down a Winston. They're gonna try to clutch still. Lend finds another kill onto Doom this time. And that you would think that would be the end of the round. Timeless gonna fall back and use the rush through good money after bad. Well, that's no joke. If you streamed so Fortnite, you'd get 10 views. No joke. Yeah, you're a fucking moron. I could turn on Fortnite anytime, and I guarantee I could still hit a thousand. No problem. You're a moron. You have no idea what you're talking about. It's the dream scenario. Dive is an absolute cleanup. The only positive is that the point's not open yet. That's that's good. And also, I mean, I guess the sentence structure could have, could have probably been the the thing that tipped me off to that the most, but. You know, that individual hack maybe not as strong as it was. Stop insulting people. Then don't fucking swing at me. Overwatch one, early Overwatch two, right? Like ages don't ago. come swinging at me if you don't want to be swung back on. It's not that fucking hard. Oh, it is brutal to get hit by that. It feels like you just have no. Treat people the way you want to be treated. It's not that difficult. If you don't like it, tough shit. Team Z now will answer back with a somber of their own. So, only difference is between these tanks. Is there a first time chatter pasta? This probably is floating around somewhere. You lose your tracer. This is quite brutal. It's going to allow timeless get an even bigger lead on this point. The tracer from Doom has been so good. Defender Kingdom. Yeah, I mean, it happens on drop days. Finding spawn drop days is when exactly you always get like the tracer. the so hard to deliver that wider crown you know really acquitting himself well in this so I mean, look at Kava, he's cleaving them up forcing so many skills now his primal does come out maybe a little bit early the beat tries to we have crazy reddit so conspiracy brain so for no reason i'm sure if i did say that to you there was a reason 10k views i meant to put that oh, okay all right i believe you 
little bit too if that's actually what you meant then that's different in the chaos finds the, what you had originally said it sounded like oh you'll you'll be nothing you'll fall off would love to get back into the room whoa squid a little too greedy um <laughs> dude how did you but no players left alive seems like timeless have done enough here the Lucio on point, gonna get swarmed, surrounded, harassed down. Yeah, but that's not and being nice. I never said I was nice. A little hiccup, we can say, on map one. Or yeah. on the, wait, wait, Do you not know how most Bostonians are? We're kind, not nice. And driving around, surviving incredibly well. I'm not gonna sugarcoat bullshit. If I feel like you're if you're spewing some nonsense in my chat, you're gonna you're gonna hear about it. I don't work customer service. Call the manager, brother. Uh, the bad part here for yeah, I'll get him. I'll get hang on. Don't worry. I got you. I'll get the manager for you Hi, this is the manager. What's going on? What do you need? Three kills and X cow the last alive ticks down to the virus and there it goes timeless What, what felt like a three zero you yeah. have one an anomaly for sure at this point yeah, and I like the decision there from Vision. Use the EMP a little bit early on. Don't get super. That's just how it is. Massive yeah. one, right? Use the EMP. Connect with two, three players. Take them out. You know, at that point, you're gonna have a massive advantage. EMP desperation comes in for peace here. Towards the end, it'll be Xcal gets on, gets a touch, trying to dance around here. But after map one, it is all timeless, and they'll take the series three-one here against Team Z. And that somber felt strong. Damn, Timeless actually made such a big comeback. They looked like they were getting rolled in the beginning and then after what we in the end looked good. Timeless because that mobility it was Somber was really always ready to drop the EMP. You like flame people even if they've been here for a while. Nope. I, you being here for a long period of time doesn't excuse you to do dumb shit. You're getting overwhelmed by that level of tempo doesn't matter i treat people that sub and and do big donos and all this other shit the same way i treat somebody who doesn't sub and hasn't been here for very long at all because you be treat you should be treated on the way you treat others you shouldn't be treated better because you've been here longer or because you give more donos or give more money i've literally banned people that have given hundreds of dollars i've told the story before it was a guy when i was in apex he used to try to also, it, like they just get rolled by. Uh, fuck, I, I lost my train of thought. They would they would constantly try to get to me to do shit or get my friends to do shit and buy and would buy try to buy them with money, and they even admitted they admitted in DMs to one of my mods that they struggle with emotional connections, so they like to buy they like to use their money to get people to do what they want. That guy got banned. We've banned one year subs before. We've banned two year subs before. If you act like a like a like a nut here. Then that's it. I didn't do anything to you. Again, you're talking about something that I don't know what you're talking about because this wherever how long will this happen? Who fucking knows? But I promise you, if I said something about it, I had a reason. I mean, for me, Squid. I mean, if I was if I'm wrong, I I try to apologize for it too. But. We're like the reason you oh my god that guy yeah that guy that guy literally gave us like hundreds of dollars of donos and then yeah. would try to go to my friends chats whenever I was in their stream and give them hundred give like hundreds of gifted subs to try to make me quote jealous so I would farm them anytime I knew they were in Karku's chat it was they were they used to go to Fran's chat a lot anytime I knew they were in there I'd pop in and say something and so they would get a couple hundred gifted subs and then I'd leave <laughs> oh, I feel so jealous. Oh, no, don't keep gifting hundreds of subs to my friends. Oh, no. You know, like, you're going to own me. Dude, I'm fucking playing you. You're not playing me. You can just eat those those cooldowns coming in. But at the top level of play, I think so, Ana starts to like I said, match up back in her favor because every time Diva you can Diva feel however the way you want, the matrix, but there's that half I think my track record pretty much shows that I'm going to treat people the same way all the way through. And if you say stupid shit and you dumb stupid, do stupid shit, you're not going to get away with it. Sometimes, sometimes I misread it or sometimes people mistype things like that guy earlier who's, who said that you'd get 10 viewers but they meant 10k but the way they typed it and very much seemed like oh you'd fall off that's why i said that to them then they're like no no could they be backtracking maybe but then they said oh i didn't mean that and i was like oh, okay i believe you because that's how you handle it